I don't know. I saw like a few yeah. days ago. He was seated under. Uh, oh God, who was it? You yesterday at? Yeah, yeah, literally yesterday. He was at Wash U. He was seated under. Uh, what was he seated? Sixth, I think. Well, I mean, I don't know who was there. Oh, we're getting right into it on FD. And we got Snake and Ness, a mashup that I know, unfortunately, far too well. Yeah. Um, yeah, as I say, you're going to be able to give more insight about this, being the best snake in St. Louis. <laughs> oh, yeah, I'm actually in St. Louis again. That's crazy. Yeah. So, this matchup is, um, can Ness actually, um, punish Snake offstage? That's basically what it comes down yeah, to. Yeah, because I feel like so many people, like, look at this matchup and they're like, her dirt, Ness absorb. Uh, but I mean, even, even if Snake didn't press the B button a single time, his normals are still just gonna outbox Ness. Yeah, his, because Snake has some of the best normals in the game, and... Ness really, on the ground especially, does not have much of anything to compete with uh, how fast Snake's uh, neutral is. Yeah, so I mean, so you said, so you said it's gonna kind of come down to how Ness does against like Snake off stage. Like, what is like, what should Ness be looking for? Because it's kind of hard when you see like Cipher yeah. getting in the way of a lot of stuff. Yeah, Cypher gets in the way of a lot of stuff, uh, but uh, Ness's PK Thunder is actually really good at juggling Snake because um, well, not only can it hit Grenade... Okay, but hang on, Ness deck. Yeah, Ness deck going kind of hard right there. Um, not only can it, it juggle Snake very well, um, Snake has to just kind of retreat to ledge sometimes against Ness. And while Cypher makes it not the worst thing in the world, because Ness can't just charge down smash because of Cypher, um, Snake trying to get back onto stage against Ness kind of has to recover high, which is exactly where Ness aerials want you to be. Yeah, and it's interesting to me that they started on FD, because I feel like, personally, just looking at this matchup, I feel like this would be a stage that favors Ness, at least in this matchup. Yeah. That was, that was nice from... Uh, Morley, Morley Joseph there. Yeah, I'm, I'm gonna probably just gonna keep calling him Morley. That is unfortunate, but yeah, I think I will too. I mean, it's like me. People call me Crime Poop. It's just yeah. It's just, most people know you as something. Okay, it's but hard. this thing's brought this back. He's got a little bit of percent on him, which unfortunately gets Snake and add up pretty quick. This is um. This is actually the other thing about this matchup that's hard to like tell what or how it's gonna happen from the beginning is uh, can the snake actually uh, correctly like mix up when he detonates C4 and stuff? Because he drops a grenade. Speaking of. Yeah. Um, I, did, I did see Nestex doing some stuff that uh, uh, Miguel Mitchmax asked you, do you think that this is snake 60-40 or closer towards even? I think this is a much closer matchup, but at the beginning of Smash Ultimate, I thought it was like Ness favored because Absorb is crazy. But I mean, I think Snake's. I, I'd say Snake's it's probably ability, 55, 45 Snake. Yeah. I think Snake's ability to just like zone and box Ness at both like points of the game, whether it be on stage or off stage, I think. Uh, I think Snake has a slight edge, but it's not a. It's not like a 60 40 matchup. Yeah. I it's did a, like it's a fairly win. Nestec was trying to mix some stuff up there because, like, typically you see Nest do down throw and then they just immediately like, kind of go into that fair or PK fire, you know, on the air dodge. Yeah. Nestec was going for some, like, down throw up air strings. Just trying to mix up, like, predicting that Morley's going to DI into it, trying to avoid that fair. So I'm going back to FD. Yeah, going back to FD, which means that Nestec is wanting it. Oh, hey. Okay. I can actually, like, see the stream now. It's... Yeah. That's nice. Yeah. Okay. Kind of dancing around each other. Both of them just kind of throwing on options and not getting anything until Morley gets that 50% strength. Yeah. That was a really nice C4 to, uh... 
C4 in there. Nestex is getting pretty lucky. He's doing some questionable air dodges that Morley is not really punishing. And what a good parry. Oh, what the heck? And that yeah. is gonna do it. He you don't even does have not to make Ness die, but he does slow all his momentum. Yep. It's um you have to be really conservative as Snake with how you use your Ooh, grenade wait, in this matchup. That, he missed the tag, but I feel like that was just really bad DI there. Yeah. What uh the weirdest part is trying to bait your opponent or trying to bait the nest into using magnet so that you can uh, punish it with something like a dash attack or a back air or something. Yeah. Because if you successfully like um, like drop a grenade and the nest is like, oh, there's a grenade on the field, I'm gonna magnet it. Uh, all y'all, literally, all you have to do is just run up dash attack. Yeah. And even if the, the Ness heals, uh, like, the 13% from the grenade, he's also going to take the 11% from the dash attack. Exactly. And, and the dash attack spot. is going to put him, yeah, in some yep. kind of disadvantage state. Okay. Ooh, Ness Morley. Thing, unfortunately, is reaching what seems to be the end of his tournament stock. Yep. I'm able to really kind of seal too much. I mean, he really only got the first stock off of Miss Tag and 4DI. So he's been unable to really get any kind of strong confirms. Yep. Nice. Right, so I was going to say, he's looking for a grab here. He needs and kind it. of like you were saying, like, Nestic was trying to space back airs, and Snake's just like, okay, I'm going to run up and dash attack. And if you miss space at all, I'm going to win that trade. Speaking and of trades, up tilt. You do not win a forward air trade with an up tilt. That is... Nope. And that is going to be a 2-0 for Mr. Joseph, punching him towards...